Welcome back everybody. West Orange Stark High School just finished with a big competition and now they are wanting to show off all their talents to the community because they're kind of amazing. So the students are in a play called Spirit on the Mountain and today we have Mason Franco who's actually the theater arts director and Alicia Odom who's a senior at West Orange Stark and you got to play the lead, right? Uh, play, yeah, one of the four one leads. Of the leads. Okay, so let's start first of all with you Mason. Tell us about you not only or the director, but you actually wrote this. Yes, yeah, so uh, I got my master's. I figured I'd put that to, to good use, right? Yeah. Is um, it the first play that you've written? No, I wrote last year's play as well. Um, okay. And But this year I, I generally try to tackle, uh, I guess, some bigger issues, right? Some some kind of higher education level okay. stuff. Okay, so you want to teach a lesson at the same time. I'm trying to, right? Okay. Um, that's kind of the idea. We, we should learn something from the plays that we watch and from the art that we kind of, I guess, take in. Okay. Um, and so I, I focus on this one was, uh, faith, right? What is faith? Mm -hmm. What, how do we view faith? How do different people from different walks of life uh, go into that? Whether it's the, the heavy leaning religious spirituality of everything, or if it's very um, dismissive, yeah, dismissive. Yeah. And, and this nonchalant. isn't nonchalant. nonchalant. This isn't what this is, has no purpose in our life unless it's to help us. Uh, okay. That's kind of the, the different routes I guess you can take with so it. So a spiritual message, and now you got to tell us, Elise, you played a witch, so uh, <laughs> tell us how the witch then portrays this spiritual message. <laughs> My witch was a con artist, and so she didn't particularly believe in this spirit on the mountain, but she definitely tried to use it to her advantage. She tried to dismiss it, belittle it, say it couldn't fulfill everybody's wishes when she could. And mm. so that's how she profited off of this religion. Mm. So you gotta be careful of <laughs> wishes yes. that can creep into our lives, right? Mm. So, and you competed with it. How'd y'all do? Uh, oh, we did we, really well. We did well. pretty good. Yeah, we did, we did better than we have in all the years previous that I've been doing this in previous competitions. Um, and uh, we're up against some, some amazing people in our district. Uh, we actually have two, yes. uh, Vider and LCM, both advanced all the way to regionals, which is one step away from state. Uh, mm -hmm. So, and I think their regional competition is this weekend, actually. So we're, we're really excited for them as well. Our, our competition even, uh, really excited for them and hope they do really well. Yes. All right, Alicia, tell me, how do you channel? It's really hard for me to get <laughs> on stage and be somebody totally different, but how do you do that? I mean, you're beautiful and sweet and oh. kind. And now you have to be a witch on stage. How do you portray that and get that, that feeling across? I feel like you just definitely have to take a moment and backstage, everybody's gathering themselves together. You have to get into the mindset of that character before you go out on that stage. and. Really, honestly, all it is, for most of us, it's just going backstage, taking a few breaths, maybe saying a few lines in character, but we all worked really hard to achieve the character we portrayed on that stage. And you're a senior, so yes. what do you want to do with this post-graduation? Well, I still want to be involved in theater, like I plan when I go to college to participate in the theater clubs and maybe some volunteer work at the local theaters, but for the most part, I want to major in mathematics or something that's educational <laughs> for other students. Wow. Very talented and smart. Oh, yeah, I'm going to be sad when she's gone, right? <laughs> uh, <laughs> okay, tell everybody how they can turn out and watch. Yeah, so uh, we're going to be performing this uh, Thursday, April 20th. That's this Thursday, uh, three different times, 10, 30, 2, 30, and 6. Uh, it is free to the public. Uh, the 10.30 and 2.30 showings will have more students uh, from the high school, but at 6 p.m., uh, that's kind of what I'm encouraging all the community to come out and, and support us. All right, fill up that auditorium. <laughs> Absolutely. Fantastic yeah. show. Thank you both for coming on. Thank you yes, so thank much for having us. Too. Thank you. Keep writing. <laughs> and you keep acting. And then remember me when you're famous. Of course. All right.